What's going on guys? So we got a new How It Should've Ended video and y'all, I'm excited to check this out because Ant-Man 3, rough like last third act. I wouldn't say the ending was terrible, but I'm curious to see what these guys have cooked up. But hey, if it's your first time on the channel, welcome in. The name is Leo Wydell. Go ahead and hit that big red subscribe button because we talk the latest in the MCU, DCU, and beyond. And today we are going over to the MCU to see the How It Should've Ended video for Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania. Let's do it. <laughs> All right, what we got here? <laughs> so you've been studying the quantum realm. Mm -hmm. Why didn't you ask me about it? I tried, Mom. Do you even know how dangerous <laughs> the quantum realm is? No, you won't ever tell us about it. You don't know what you're dealing with down there. It's fine. Just let me turn it on and show don't you. Don't you dare turn on whatever that thing is. Why? Fine. You really want me to tell you? Yes, tell like us. So yeah. <laughs> I mean, seriously, that's all she had to do was tell them. Wow. Okay, so yeah, we won't ever do anything with the quantum realm. <laughs> Meanwhile, <laughs> any minute now, someone somewhere out there will send a signal. And that's <laughs> when I'll catch them. <laughs> Not any happening. Any minute now. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Oh my goodness, is that Louise? <laughs> Stop, bro. Did I get him? Oh my Louise. god. Yeah, man, what's up? How did you get here? <laughs> oh man, you're not gonna believe it, right? Oh my oh, god, he tells the whole story, yes. When all of a sudden, these giant ants We missed through. Louise, like, bro. Whoa, are you some kind of highly evolved ants from beyond space and time <laughs> sent to give me some kind of important message? And the ant was like, yeah, dog. We've been trapped down in the quantum realm, getting all sorts of <laughs> stuff. Yeah, what? dog. He was like, yeah, the crap's been getting really bad down there. And Scott's <laughs> been getting mixed up with this evil dude named Kang. I said, oh no, Scott, that's my boy. And the ant said, no doubt, no doubt. So after doing like tons of science and stuff, we were like, yo, you know who is like a really important missing piece to all of Ant-Man's success? Luis. Luis, yeah. Said, yeah, we should get him down Let's here. Let's go. Universe and stuff. Luis, and like, bro, bring Luis back. Yeah. Then it was like, wait. If you're so smart, and you came all this way to find me, why didn't you just use like your super ant technology to just bring everyone back home? And the ant said, do you want to be in this story or not? I mean, good point. Yes. <laughs> wow, that is incredible. You think these ants and a man can defeat me? I am K! And I still have holes! <laughs> Oh my god, dude. The ants and Luis and the talking clock <laughs> translator whose thing saved the day. Well, yeah. Basically, that's how it went. And what happened to that oh orphan? Oh, well, Stop. the ants being in a class. I have holes for it. can't be trusted with such a powerful device, so they took it. And that's good? Oh. Of course it is. I love ants. I, I don't ever get upset about anything they do. You know what I would have done? I'm going to guess reboot. What? Oh. You wash your... Reboot. Actually, yeah, that actually checks <laughs> out. Rebooting? You hush your. Oh, it is. But it always works out for him for some reason. Because I'm Batman. Anyways, <laughs> are you sure Kang is gone for good? Yeah. I mean, we all saw him get eaten. I'm sure that's the last we'll see of him. What's mm -hmm. up, Kang? Not a lot, Kang. How you doing, Kang? Just Kang get with the Kang. <laughs> Kang, right? Oh, the Kang. Baltimore Kang? Where the Joker. Where did all of these Kangs come from? I told you. <laughs> oh, my God. You know what bugs me? When they kept taking their helmets off to talk to each other? Yes, but... Yeah. No. Is it recasty? Hey! <laughs> no. No, the mind-reading guy. He has this incredible power to read your mind, and then... All he does is use it to find the combination for a bridge. That's it? Yeah, that bugs me. Yeah? It's just weird. Oh, That's there fair. are a lot of things in the quantum realm that are weird. Yeah. But not you. You look oh. great, by the way. Thanks. Uh -oh. I was starting to think you wouldn't remember me. Oh, I would never forget that. <laughs> oh. oh, don't tell me you had a relationship with Batman too. I have needs, Hank. Ew. Ew. Oh my oh. gosh. Oh. <laughs> I really should have been good. Okay. I can't let you have it. You'll destroy countless timelines. Well, in that case, then I'll just take it. What? 
You chose poorly, Janet. Oh, poop. Oh. <laughs> Okay! <laughs> Alright, so another good addition of how it should have ended. A little awkward there with the Kang stuff. I'm like, ugh, Jonathan Majors. But, man, a really good how it should have ended, of course. Listen, that first, the first one where it was just like, she just told everybody. I was like, thinking to myself, when I was watching the movie, I'm like, why doesn't she just tell them? Like, why didn't she just have that conversation? Like, okay, and why didn't anybody stop and say, like, why don't you just tell us, Janet? Why don't you just tell us? But... Another interesting how it should have ended, guys. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments. What did you think about this episode? And hey, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button for your boy. And we'll see you next time on Geekly Goods.